from Indy's streaming news leader. This is a WRTV update. Good afternoon, I'm Mark Mullins with a look at your top stories connecting Indy's near west side to downtown. We now have our first look at the site where the Henry Street Bridge will span. The city says this project has uncovered some significant pieces of history. We've learned the site was home to the largest electric railway freight terminal in the U.S. The site was also the first and largest cemetery in Indianapolis. It's why city officials are taking a new approach to the project. Our process is going to be led by an archaeological team. Um, and we're going to document everything and share that transparently with the public. Um, and that's going to be different for a, a type of project like this. The city says it has already uncovered fragments of human remains during pre-construction. They estimate 650 or more graves could be found. Excavation starts next month and is expected to be finished by spring. The entire bridge project should be complete by 2026. 17 congregations from around the state are getting help to repair and preserve their historic houses of worship. The money comes from a $2.4 million Lilly Endowment grant given to Indiana Landmarks. Among the recipients, Allen Chapel AME Church in Indianapolis, the First Christian Church in Newcastle, Gobin Methodist Church in Greencastle, Irvington Presbyterian Church, and Mount Zion Baptist Church in Indy. We have a complete list in this story at WRTV.com. Temperatures this afternoon will get back above normal for the first time this week as we climb into the upper 60s and low 70s across the area. Uh, 71 in Lafayette, 68 in India as well as Richmond. This evening, if you have Friday night plans, the last sunset after 7 p.m. Uh, starting tomorrow, sunset uh, will be before 7 o'clock and temperatures will be falling into the 50s as this evening progresses. And then overnight tonight, clear skies, chilly once again, 30s and 40s for your overnight lows. And then as we start off your week, Weekend. Saturday we start chilly as you saw there, but we get up to 72 in the afternoon. Uh, lots of sunshine should be beautiful. Then Sunday a couple degrees even warmer than your Saturday as we'll be topping off right around 74. We stay in the 70s by the way all the way through the middle of next week.